Let's work on this Asus laptop that came in for no power. We already disassembled the board. I was actually working on the 3080 Ti graphics card. And in the video, Big Boss brought this board in and he said no power. I did not want to combine and include this repair along with the video card. So we're going to do a separate video. We're going to start by checking the DC connector. We have one MOSFET here, and based on my experience working on those boards, we should have a MOSFET on the other end of the board from the very top, but we need to flip the board. We want to measure here and see if we have a short. And I can almost guarantee you that we're going to have a short. And we do. You see? We have a short. Without wasting any time, let's inject voltage at the short. And we will monitor the board under a thermal camera and see what gets hot. And we'll take it from there. This may end up being a two-minute fix. Or it may end up being a 10 minutes fix. Who knows? Right now, what I want to do is inject voltage on the current sense resistor on the back here, where we had the short. And then we're going to monitor the board under a thermal camera like this. I'm injecting voltage with the probe, so I'm holding the board and the probe at the same time. Point the probe at the current sense resistor. And then I need to remove the cover from my thermal camera like this. Oh, I do see a heat spot. Let me show you what I mean. We got it. So let me point my probe at the current sense resistor and we can go here, you see? From what I could tell, we have a heat spot right over here. But I may be wrong. It could be here or it could be here. What we can do is we can inject voltage and maybe put a few drops of alcohol in this area and see where alcohol evaporates first. That's one way of doing it. We can also use an atomizer, which is a lot more accurate and you can see a lot better when you are using rosin powder. And because the camera is FLIR, I bought it about 10 years ago, you cannot mount it on any tripod. You need a special adapter from FLIR so you can mount the camera on the tripod. It's not a standard mount. But then again, that's FLIR. If you want to waste your money, you can buy FLIR. I'm injecting voltage right now. And I'm just going to put some alcohol here, here, here. Oh, look, you see? Right there. Right there. Look at the cap, how alcohol is evaporating first because it's heating up. We got the bad guy. You see how we still have alcohol on this cap, but not on this one? The problem is this guy right here. Say hello to the bad guy. And this bad capacitor reminds me of a drawing somebody did for us a while back. Let me show it to you quick. That's me right here, my hot tweezers to my right. And you have the bad capacitor right here, the bad guy. So the tweezers to my right, and his name is Rufus. He came to pull that bad capacitor out. That bad cap is causing problems, and it's time to kick him out. I love it. Which one was it? Yeah, right there, right there. Got it. Let's get Rufus to pull that guy out. And before we test again, let me just grab the pads because I'm 110% sure that that's the bad guy. Just like that. And just like that. And while at it, let's measure, make sure the short is gone. We can measure at the MOSFET that we initially measured that. Let's be fair. You see? You see? We do not have a short anymore. We have a voltage drop of 0 0.42. And we measured the exact same MOSFET we measured before unlike 
skin products where they show you a before and after. Before, the light is different, the person is grumpy, sad face, and after, when they apply the skincare on their face, suddenly you have a great light in the room, the person is smiling, and the face looks good. That's called false advertising. Let's grab a cap. And if you do not already know, you can purchase the caps from our site, filters, hot air station, soldering station, thermal cameras, grinding pan, tweezers, flux, wick, whatever we use here in the shop, we carry and sell on our site. If it's in stock, add to cart, buy it, and we almost always ship out same day. So those caps are sold on our site because we use them every single day. And we paid more for those caps. They are high quality capacitors and we're going to use our hot tweezers to solder that cap no hot air today first we have to grab it good boy you're a good boy the other guy was a bad boy, and he's out. Rufus took care of him. Do not misbehave, otherwise Rufus will come for you. And you do not want to mess with Rufus. No offense to anybody named Rufus, but every Rufus I knew was a little rough on the edges. I don't know. Okay, we're done. I'm gonna hand this board over to Big Boss to reassemble and test. And maybe I'll finish the video with Big Boss testing the laptop.